crisis continues as over 100 headsmen have just been killed in Ogun. Seriki cries out to federal government. More than 100 headsmen have been killed in Ogun state. Seriki Fulani of Igwa in Yewa North local government area of Ogun state, Adamu Ibrahim, revealed that more than 100 Fulani headsmen were killed in the area. Seriki further stated that some communities like Asha, Agmo, Ujudru, and others along Oja, Oda, Axis had killed many cows and elders during the period. While speaking in an exclusive interview with Daily Post, he said he had lost count of how many cows were killed within the last five years, stating that over 100 headers were killed now. Thank you for listening to this news. You people should save yourself and leave the state quietly. You people are the one causing all of this on yourselves. If you have left this place quietly, I see no reason why these people will be attacking you. Some of you have listened and have left and they have been saved. It's just the stubborn ones among you that still doesn't want to leave. You see that and it's wrong. These people are saying that they don't want to they don't want to see you people in their environment. It's not by force. It's not by force. It is a decision and they have their reasons. They have their reasons. Why can't you just listen? Eh? Okay, look at. See what is happening now. See what is happening. Okay, because you people have said you are not... Uh, because they have said that they don't want to see you people in their, in their state anymore. Or in their community anymore. That now warranted you people... To, um, to say okay for that reason you are not supplying them with any food or you are not going to drop any food for this um, for the westerners or for the easterners in their market it means that you people are even calling for more war and okay now you tell me wouldn't that be enough reason why they will say they don't even want to see you people at all and if you decide to investigate this issue that have happened right now in Ogun, you will see that something has warranted the killing of this headsman. Something has warranted it. These people cannot just wake up and say they want to start killing you people. Because I know that I'm I'm not I'm not biased to I'm not biased. I'm just telling you, I know that definitely you people may have been the one that attract the fight that attracted the fight because i know that there can never be a smoke without fire and in that process they have to take that opportunity of asking you people to leave to strike on you people to strike on you people you see that so, I tell you this, you have to be reasonable. You have to be reasonable. Your, uh, your governors have come together, they have reasoned together, they have seen reason why they should, um, they should get you people, they should, they should prepare uh, a place for you people so that you people can find it comfortable why you return back to your state? Why you return back to your state? But some of you are still finding it difficult to 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 understand. To understand, you are still forcing yourself in a community that doesn't want you, in a state that doesn't want you.
in a state that is rejecting you. Huh? You see that? So whose fault is it? Whose fault is it? To me, there is no way I would say that is the fault of anyone because you people invited the crisis on yourselves. When people say they don't want you, they don't want you. Forget the fact that the governors are supporting and asking you people to stay. The governors, yes, they elected the governor. Is it the governor that is living with them? They are the one. They, they are the one that knows where it's pinching them. That's why they, 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 they are saying no to you people because they know what you people are capable of doing. Huh? They know what you people are capable of doing. So the the governors should not dictate for them. Should not dictate for them. So. What is happening today is as a result of what, uh, what has taken place in Oyo and what is still taking place. And because they have said that they don't want to see any of you in their environment, that alone should have passed a permanent information to you people. But you people don't want to listen. You don't want to listen. You will start saying, oh, can, how can I leave? How can I leave that giant building that I've built in the, in the southwest? You see that? So all these things are what we are lamenting of. All right? So I will say that you people are the ones killing yourselves and not the, and they are not the ones killing you. If only you have listened to your to your governors, to your to your elders that have demanded that you people should start coming, I'm very sure that this wouldn't have happened to you. Very, very sure. Very, very sure. So whose fault is that? What sport is that? Look at over 100 headers and their cows. What a great loss. What a great loss. We are not even talking about the cows. We are talking about humans. Humans. Huh? I am of the opinion that you people should find your way out of the Southwest. To put an end to this unnecessary menace. There is no way I will be sympathetic with you people because you people are the ones that invited this on yourselves. You invited it on yourselves. Leave the governors alone. Leave them alone. Don't listen to them. These people are the owner of the state. You understand? So... That is just the humble truth. So, my viewers, um, based on this matter, I don't know what your own opinion concerning this may be, but please, whatsoever it is, do it free to leave your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.